miraculous J Van Tide's coming today. So as you guys know, Love Island is back. I don't give a fuck. Don't watch the show. It's fucking shit. Hi, like, nobody gives a fuck about anybody because they're only relevant for one year. Actually, no, this is the Windsor one. So no one would give a fuck about you at the start of the summer. But I thought I'd make this video giving the J Van Tine's opinions on some of these islanders. There best be some fit birds going in this year. I swear down, bro. Please be a bird who's got bite. All right, meeting the islanders. Let's get it. I'm not good at selling TVs. I can sell a TV when it's not even on. What the fuck was that intro like? Was that meant to be a flex? Like, who even asked? Already I don't like this kid. Hi, I'm Harris, 21 years old. I'm a TV salesman from Doncaster. Yorkshire boy. <sighs> Explains a lot. And what the fuck was that little wink there? What makes me good as a TV salesman is... You couldn't even get rid of free samples, you knobhead. No one's actually met my mum. <laughs> Why is he even laughing? Like, that wasn't even funny. This guy's moist. You can have a good session. Get sweaty. <laughs> Again, why is he laughing? Like, nobody's laughing. Why is he doing some of the shittest shadow boxing I've ever seen in my life? Like, sit down, you cunt. You sell TVs for a living. I've never actually found the right girl. I've never fell in love. Just what every single girl wants to hear. My friend. <laughs> Fucking hell, bro, stop. You're actually embarrassing yourself. Friends describe me as confident, hyper, and up for everything, literally. None of your friends have ever described you as that. Stop capping. My mum always tells me I look like Ronaldo. Your mum's fucking deluded. Looks like Ronaldo, yeah. If he never played football and wasn't rich, and was still a fucking virgin. I've got the chat, I've got the energy. You've got as much chat as a corpse, mate. Well, that was Harris, like, he was just a fucking idiot. Guaranteed he's the first one that gets booed off the island. I'm Will, I'm 23, I'm a farmer, and I'm from Buckingham. Oh my days, he sounds and looks like a posh con. One thing leads to another, and you know, we're in the back of a tractor, on the back of a trailer, and... Naughty. You ain't bringing no birds to shag him in the back of the tractor. Stop the cat! Girls are in my DMs asking, ah, oh, can I come to the farm? I'm not gonna lie, he honestly sounds gay. Like, is he gay? Not that there's anything wrong with that. Like, I actually love gays, like... Not, not like that, not like that. On a night out, I am an absolute loose cannon. You don't strike me as a guy who's a loose cannon. Like, you seem like the type of champagne and prosecco posh twat. I'm 100% gonna miss my animals going into the villa. You can tell this guy's into bestiality. He defo fucks his cows and horses. Okay, that was Will. Nothing more to say. He's a posh twat. Come on, man, let's get one of the birds in here. And I see someone I like, I'll just like look over, give them like the two second look. Oh my God. I cringe myself. I literally just died a fucking cringe there. What the shit? I'm Olivia, I'm 27. I'm 27? You look way older than that. I know that's rude, yeah, but like... Fuck your feelings. When I have my moment, I'm like, yeah, everyone's looking at me. And <laughs> really, they probably don't care. So. Girl, nobody's looking at you. Like, they don't give a fuck. Like, when I'm smashing out your body, like, I prefer you don't look at me. I started off with musical theatre, and then I went into TV acting. Recently, I... Nobody gives a fuck if you're an actress. Nobody cares. She cares about herself way too much. I know sometimes I do shit like that, but... I'm self-aware. She was like, oh, I was on a TV show, but I don't want to bring that up. She thinks she's so sweet, but I see your true colours, girl. I've met the mum bowling with the family. They'll treat me like their girlfriend, but just never with the label. Yeah, I'm not surprised. She's definitely the one night stand type of bird. Very confident, fun, very flirty. She thinks she's the shit, let's be honest. Although I've never had a boyfriend, so yeah, doesn't work. <laughs> Nothing was funny about that. Why are you laughing? That was Olivia. She was just too full of herself. Nothing special about her. Is she fit? I'd give her a 7 out of 10. Like, if I saw her at a club, like, I would try and pull her. But nothing more than that. When I'm single, let's just say I like to move a little bit reckless. <laughs> when I'm single, I like to move a little bit reckless. Doesn't every single guy do that? I'm Shaq, I'm 24. There's only one Shaq that I know, and he played for the Lakers, and you ain't him. I've had a few rumors about me going around as well, but 
Only some of them are true. <laughs> he says there's rumors about him, but doesn't want to say him and then laughs. Where's the joke in that? Some of these islanders think they're so funny, like laughing at their own jokes. You're not funny, just leave it at that. They have their hair done all nice, makeup done. And obviously you want discounted flights as well, so. <laughs> Again, not funny. Some of these lot just have no personality. Oi mate, are you going on Love Island to actually find love? Nice to know the truth. Let's just say I found a few adult toys <laughs> and her 75 year old husband was behind looking mortified. Okay, don't know what that has to do with Love Island, but okay. Once I, I meet a girl and I feel like I can open up, and turn into a big teddy bear. You're a fucking pussy -o. You never ever tell your girlfriend about your feelings, you pussy! She has to match that. Nice eyes, nice lips, good body. I'm not asking for much, am I? Not asking for much, am I? How confident am I? I'd probably say about 11. To Bullshit! 11. You said that you would turn into a big teddy bear. Therefore, what a confident person would say. <laughs> it's shack time. <laughs> it's shack time. Fuck me, these islanders are so... So cringy. So that was Shaq. Felt like he was playing a bit of a softy and wanna be confident guy. He's a fucking pussy, yo. He ain't getting no birds. I'm Anna Mae. I'm 20 years old and I'm a payroll administrator from Swansea. Oi, mate, this bird is fit. Besides the accent. They can't shut me up and I find them sometimes looking at me like... Okay, can I get a word in now sort of thing? Oh, fuck this girl. She talks too much. I chatted so much that he actually started to fall asleep at the dinner table. <laughs> it was hysterical. She is the definition of just looks and no personality. Like, she's lucky she's fit. Well, let's be honest, the producers of Love Island ain't gonna bring ugly birds on TV. Like, they need to sell the show. Talk to someone for maybe a week, meet them once, and I'm in love. Oh, she's one of them birds that get hooked onto a guy so easily. Where are you going? Who are you going with? Are there gonna be other girls there? Girl, I literally had one date with you. I tend to get obsessed with boys really quickly. Um, yeah, that's not a surprise. Like, I had somebody dropping off cream eggs at my door every Friday because I told him once I like cream eggs. That's too nice for me. I enjoyed the cream eggs, though. This is what I hate about some girls, like, they never give the guy a chance, but we'll take full advantage of them. This is why I always encourage guys to be bad boy dickheads so I can get birds. Oh, mate, she's lucky she's fit. I'm excited to get into the villa and hopefully meet the love of my life. Stop lying. You're going on there to get a few more followers on Instagram, get that blue check mark, and sell teeth whitening products to young dumb twats. Quite a competitive person, especially when it comes that to- That girl talked too much. Fuck me. Thank God that's over. Anime, she's just fit. It, that's it. No personality. Hi, my name is Tanya. I'm 22 years old and I'm a biomedical science student from Liverpool. Oi, oi, Scouse, man. I love the Scouse accent. Okay, what you got for us, Tanya? Definitely the last girl standing. I will literally be on the dance floor. It doesn't matter what song I'm on the dance floor and one tequila shot, I'll speak to the guy that I want to speak to. I'm not afraid to shoot my shot at all. She's got some confidence, I like that. But she needs a tequila shot to speak to him. I don't need no influence, mate. Like, if I want to pull a bird, I just use the J Valentine charm and they're instantly on my dick. People like to do like, uh, Snapchat, Instagram. I Snapchat, are you fucking 14? I'm that girl who would be in the toilets in the club like, oh my God, I love your makeup, I love your dress, where's it from? Oh my God, let me fix your hair, let me fix your dress. Like, literally typical scouts babe. Why would you help another girl look bad? That just makes the competition even more harder. I would never do that for some random dickhead that I met at a club. She's too nice, honestly, like. I'm not gonna beg it and I will look elsewhere. She doesn't sound proper scouse, like, I can't hear it, like. Can you? Where's that scouse accent, love? Guys who are not unreal, but they're not ugly. Like, somebody else might think, no, he's not a bit of me. I'm like, that's a bit of me. So you'll take second best. That mindset is shit. I never settle for the runners up medal. I go for the gold. You're not saying. So I'll have like, let's say four guys at once. And I'm just trying to see who is going to impress me. Who Four guys at once. Okay. That's good. So don't get pissed off when I'm talking to six other different birds. Guarantee she's not like that. The double standards. So Tanya, I think she's capping about the Scouse accent. Like, I can't hear no Scouse. She's fucking lied to me. I've been finessed. I don't like girls who lie, yeah, but she seems very nice.
Maybe a bit too nice. A grown man throwing a paper plane. What the fuck? I'm Karen, 24, and I'm a science- 24? You look about 29. It's the same as strict teacher, but when I shout, the kids laugh. So <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how that goes with them. No. It's because you're a fucking joke, mate. They don't take you seriously. Shocked reaction when girls find out I'm a teacher. To be honest, I think that they kind of like it. I've never met a bird who said my dream man's job should be a teacher. No girl has ever said that. I've had mums arrange meetings to meet with Mr. Fagan. I've come down. Next thing I know, they've left their numbers with reception, waiting to see if I'm going to call them back. If that kid knew that his mum did that, I guarantee he would never speak again. <laughs> Why not? If a kid ever gives you shit, just say to him, mate, I jizzed on your mum's face last night. I'm going to be your stepdad soon. So shut your fucking mouth, you little cunt. I'd actually be a well sick teacher. But I don't want to be. I fucking hate kids. They're little bastards. Girls most of the time say my best feature is my height. I'm six foot four. Oh, you know, fuck off. I'm fucking jealous of that. Six foot four. What I'd do to be that tall, I'd actually give up my first child to acquire that. If I do like a girl, within the first date, I'll probably end up falling in love with her. <laughs> Why do you always catch feelings after seeing them once? Pussies! Value all your options, guys. Fuck me. People probably call me a bit of a simp when it comes to things like that, but it's fine. They're fucking right. Caring, I'd do anything for them if you've got me. I don't think I'm that bad looking either. He seems like a nice guy, but you know what they say about nice guys. They get no fucking bitches. The chase on if she wants to chase him, all the lads are going to realise that that's my girl. That's your girl, mate. I'll fucking walk into the villa. She'll look at me and instantly turn into a water fountain. So, Kai. I like your name, but unfortunately, that's all I like about you and your height. You're too nice. I'm sorry, bro. Cowboy hat on the back of my arm. Everyone kept saying that it was because I like reverse cowgirl. <laughs> Again, nobody is laughing except you. You're not funny. I'm Lana. I'm 25 years old. Lana? Oi, that's the name of my favourite porn star. Anna, Anna Kubelik. Lightens up a room. 2022. 2022. Anna Why did the producers leave that in? Like, nobody gives a fuck. Yeah, and España para 10 años y ahora. She can speak Spanish. Yes, girl, so can I. Hola, chica, quiero felate. I like Lana so far. She's ticking a few boxes. Favourite porn star's name? Blonde. Manchester. The bird is riding the Valentine Express. First willpower when it comes to playing hard to get, and I'll end up sending a paragraph saying i love you let's just be together <laughs> so you're not hard to get you sound so easy won't be our charming you so that's lana yeah she's fit she's spanish and she's manny she's riding first class bro i'm gonna fill her up with my load i get the ick so quickly the minute i get too much attention i'm i'm out that way nobody fucking ass it's just drama 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 fucking hell you can see she's got a proper fat bay on her I realised over time that I was going for like bad boy. Mate, look at her bunda. Like, I don't give a fuck what she's saying. Like, I'm just thinking about smashing that body out. But obviously, when my head turns to someone who's a bad boy, of course. She'll turn her head for a bad boy. Unlucky, guys. Make way for the J Valentine. Important to have sexual chemistry with a guy. She knows she's got a fat body. Like, she's proper flaunting it now. But hey, I ain't complaining. Could be the most good looking guy ever, and I will not fancy you if you're not funny. Like, I need someone to have me laughing in tears. Something yeah, I don't really care about all the talking bollocks. As long as we've got the sexual chemistry, I don't care. Fuck personality. Tall, handsome. I love a tan. Muscly, but I don't like it when they're like so muscly that they can't fit through the door. Tall, handsome, tan and muscly. She's basically describing me. They like my bunda. And also they like my personality. No, we don't care about your personality. You've got a proper fat bay and that's all we care about. I can't wait to get myself into the villa. I just want to stop it with the bad boys, leave them in the past and find- Yeah, shut up, girl. Every girl wants a bad boy. Even if they say they don't want it, they're fucking capping. So that was- how the fuck do you say a name? Tanyelle. So that was Tanyelle. All I've got to say is she's got a proper fat body. Gonna think about that when I'm next in the shower. I'm Ron, I'm 25. I'm financial advisor from Essex. Wouldn't be Love Island without someone from Essex. When I'm chatting to a girl or when I get to know him, that soft side comes out so quick. Another little fucking pussy -o. It's got to be my eyes because they're two different colours. Girls like What the fuck? Oi, that's well sick. Holy shit. Mate, that is West. That is the only freak feature that I ever won. Settling down so early, I thought it was a waste. I've definitely been making the most of single life for the last four years. Finally, a guy who's spitting facts. 
If you're single, you should be taking advantage of that every single day. Shag any bird that you want and never see them again. Whether I'm sober, whether I'm one drink or ten drinks in, I'm first on the dance floor. I got the like this. You know what? I kind of like this guy. He kind of reminds me of me a little bit. Just without the good looks and the charm and the jackness. As long as they're pretty and as long as they're a nice girl and I've got a bit of chat, I'm game. See, this guy doesn't give a fuck. He'll shag the bird who's good looking. Don't give a fuck about her hair colour and shit. Yeah, I see a lot of myself in this guy. Oh, I can't wait to see the girls in the villa. Sorry to tell you this, bro, but all the birds in there have dead chat. Don't have high expectations, bro. I'm just looking out for my bro. Like, I want him pulling, kid. Girls will not find people like me. I don't want to blow my own trumpet, but I am a diamond in the rough. See, he's cocky, arrogant, a dickhead. He's basically my twin. Just minus all the tall, dark, handsome and jacked. Yeah, Ron, he's a pretty sound guy. Definitely kind of guy that I would be mates with. He kind of reminds me of one of my mates. Hope this guy breaks all the girls' hearts in there and pulls the most birds. Don't stick to one bird, bro. Explore the field. It's a small pond with a lot of fish. Okay, that's the end of that. They were all the contestants going on Love Island this year. The birds there are... Um, Mid. Except the one with the absolute fat batty and the manny bird. The guys there are all a bunch of virgin dickhead pussy holes. Except Ron, he's actually sound like. He's the only one spitting facts. But let's be honest, I ain't gonna watch Love Island. That show is so moist. They're all going on there to boost up their Instagram followers and be the next brand ambassador for Boohoo. They don't give a fuck about the show. Just the attention and the brand deals. If someone can send me the Instagram handle of that girl with the absolute fat bite, that would be much appreciated. I'm gonna have a wet dream about her tonight. So guys, if you like the video, don't to like, subscribe, share it, mates, and I'll see you all later. I don't wanna hurt you, baby, but I can't stay with you now. Maybe together.